And what I was seeing this morning, just in, in, in worship, in this session, Pastor, was this, this, um, this, this uh, like a building season. I just see a building anointing on you. It's like um, the great architect in heaven has this plan that is being like unfolded that is not only involving the region here, but I see it in nations. And the Lord's going to give you invitation to build in nations. And, um, and I see that you've been building a spiritual house. In fact, I think it was around 14 years ago, um, I felt the Lord say that he put, put a vision in your heart. And it was just like Joseph, that after Joseph had his dream, it was like all hell broke loose sort of thing. Um, but um, in that process, this authority got built in him. So when it came to pass, when it actually came to pass, he brought deliverance to two nations in a really critical hour because God had prepared him unto it. And I sense the Lord saying that he's prepared you for this hour. And he says, arise and shine because this is your time to shine. This is your, your time to shine. And I, I just see this scroll. It's like a blueprint out of heaven unfolding. And there's expansion. There's there's addition, there's, there's rearrangement of things, even infrastructures and things that are going to have to be redefined and restructured for this next season because expansion is coming on certain dreams, certain things you've seen in the past that have yet to be fulfilled. He says, hold on to those words, hold on to the vision because this is your time to shine. And I see out of this house, I just see the nations being so touched. I see schools of ministry being established in different nations. I see, um, uh, in particular, I see the continent of Africa. I believe that this house is going to have connection there to raise up leaders who will, who will be true revivalists in every sense of, of the word. So I also sense the, the word like, um, you know, in the natural, in order to release the rain there has to be the vapor of the earth has to go up so the vapor of the uh, the the earth goes up and and it collects and then falls as rain whoa and um in in your house at this time the vapor of worship and intentional intercession to to bring target it's like certain focuses that you're going to have in prayer to birth the vision of the lord i see it going up and then this huge mass of cloud is collecting the vapor and pouring down rain so um there's um the lord says um to you know his house is called a house of prayer and um i know as a ministry every morning we gather our team together they actually get paid for this as part of their their uh paid day is we gather for one hour of worship um of of meditating on the word prayer and communion Whoa. And the Lord spoke really strong to us. He said, my house is called a house of prayer. And so make that a priority. And all your prayers get answered when you pray according to his will. So, so connect uh, with him and pray according to his will because he hears you. So I just want to bless this house. I think it's fabulous what God is doing here and through you all. And, uh, you know, give the Lord a big praise right now for all his goodness shown to this house. He is good. Amen. <laughs> oh.